photographers here are aggressive and they scream at you. And then like a lot of times it's like you just go stand on this little stage and then you walk off. But like they want you to be on there for like three minutes. And after about a minute that I'm on there, I'm like, okay, my mouth hurts and this feels weird. <laughs> so I look, look over and I make sure that I'm allowed to come off and someone's like, yes, you can come off. Thank you, it's good to be here. Hola. I'm just like a quiet person. I'm not one of those people who is like really talkative and stuff. I'm like, I don't know. I'm a singer. I've seen that your look has changed from what you did before and now it's more of a grown-up look. And I thought it was a little bit more commercial and a little bit more uh, glamorous, maybe. I feel like I still sort of have the same style. It's just, I'm a girl, you know? I love makeup, clothing, you know, I love fashion, shoes, bags, all that stuff. It's fun. What do you think about uh, Mexican fans? I think they're awesome, and I'm really excited because definitely one of the best crowds. Thank you. Every night before I have a concert, there's always a meet and greet. I, I always choose to do it before the show. It's usually between 30 to 60 people that I take photos with and sign autographs. You know what? Sure. Can't be better for there. Meet you. Enjoy the show. Thank you. I am making some last-minute adjustments to her outfit. I have to make sure that everything is tacked on properly so it doesn't fall during the show. I'm not officially on tour, but I am playing a full-on concert tonight. Which is that it's actually a little challenging. I have to go over my set list and think about the show and stuff to get like back into it. Because when you don't sing for a month, like a full set, and then you have to sing for 75 minutes straight, it's easy to like lose your voice. So I'll probably ask my guitar player Jim to do warm-ups. Me, me, me. Like, like things I like to say on stage is hello and like thank you and how are you? Are you having fun? Gracias. Salas Merhor. Merhor? It's amazing what adrenaline can do to your body. Like the second I get out, if I'm not feeling good or if I have a headache or if like I'm really tired or if I'm really jet lagged or. I'm just under the weather, like the second I get up on stage, I'm like, this is what I love, this is why I'm here, this is why I'm doing all this traveling. I have a new band, and my band is really good, like top-notch musicians, and I have dancers, and I have, I have like actual stage outfits, and the show is much more upbeat and energetic, and it's a, it's more fun. There's always like kids around. There's usually a fence and I go over that. And that's the exciting part. I, li I like that signing after after the show. It's cool because it gives me a chance to meet my fans and you know for them to meet me. And it's a thing that we do every single concert. Coming up on Avril in Mexico. We found some interesting meal options. I see worms. Oh, oh my god, this is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh, hey, Avril, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 